Summary Paul's anniversary wish for Corrine included sharing screenshots of her OnlyFans page and promoting her adult modeling content, but also calling her a derogatory term. Fans suspect that Paul's actions are a desperate cry for attention and that he may be using the situation to advertise Corrine's content and gain more subscribers. Previously, Paul claimed to be dating someone else and stated that he and Corrine were no longer together due to their incompatibility and toxic relationship. However, he later confirmed that they were back together in April 2023, 90-day fiancé, before the 90 Days star Paul Stale is shocking fans with his odd anniversary wish for estranged wife Corrine Martins. Paul, 40, and Corrine, 27, are one of the most controversial couples in the franchise. Paul and Corrine met online when they were introduced on 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Days Season 1. The Louisville man and the Brazilian woman, Corrine, who lived along the Amazon River with her family struggled to communicate due to their language barrier. Despite their differences, they married in 2017 and welcomed their son Pierre in 2018. Corrine joined Paul in Kentucky in 2019, and their relationship issues have been escalating. Their second son, Ethan, was born in 2021 amid arguments about infidelity. In December 2021, a clip circulated online, showing Paul and Corrine physically fighting inside their home, which caused Paul and Corrine to lose custody of their sons. Ethan and Pierre are now with the same foster family. Paul and Corrine began fighting for the custody of their kids, however, in August 2023, Corrine claimed Paul had gone missing in Brazil. She even shared a cryptic post hinting Paul was dead. Paul returned to Instagram in September 2023, claiming he never went missing. Paul calls Corrine a WH asterisk E on wedding anniversary Paul's anniversary wish for Corrine on November 3, 2023, was unusual. Paul started by sharing a screenshot of Corrine's OnlyFans page, which showed a green dot next to her profile picture, suggesting she was active. Paul added a link to her page on his story. His next story contained a screenshot of Corrine's unfiltered D page. It's a platform similar to OnlyFans, launched by 90 Day Fiancé cast member Stephanie Matto. Paul then proceeded to share photos from his and Corrine's November 3, 2017, wedding. Paul used the song, I Write Sins Not Tragedies, in the story. He highlighted certain lyrics to Panic! at the Disco 2005 song, as shared by Reddit user U, Fabulous underscore Minute underscore 9929. Paul made sure the lyrics, what a beautiful wedding, says a bridesmaid to a waiter, and yes, but what a shame, what a shame the poor groom's bride is a wh re, were on the screen alongside three different photos from their wedding. Paul then shared three more pictures set to the tune of Bishop Bullwinkle's, Hell to Da Na Na. His final story was another link to Corrine's OnlyFans page. Does Paul have ulterior motives? Paul's stories make it look like he is not together with Corrine. However, fans suspect Paul's stories are desperate cries for attention. On the one hand, he shamed his wife by calling her a WH re, but on the other hand, he also promoted her adult modeling content by sharing multiple links. Paul and Corrine used to creative content together when they launched the account. Moreover, Paul's confusing antics also remind viewers of the time when Corrine posted about his disappearance and shared a video alluding to his death when he was very much alive. Paul's stories about Corrine could be him advertising her content so curious followers could subscribe. Paul claims he's dating someone new Paul confirmed he was officially back with 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 Days star Corrine in April 2023.
However, in October, Hall claimed he and Kareem were no longer together as she was dating several different men. Hall had decided to clear the air after a photo of Paul and Kareem at Disneyland had gone viral on the internet. At the same time, Hall also confirmed he was dating someone else. On October 8, 2023, Hall told his Instagram followers he was talking to an ingenious woman native of Amazonas. He maintained he wanted a peaceful friendship with Kareem because they were both tired of their obviously toxic incompatibility. Sources Paul Staloy, Fabulous underscore Minute underscore 9929, Reddit, Paul Stale, Instagram 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Days release date, the 6th of August 2017 cast, Angela Deem, Gino Palazzolo, Kareem Martins, Stephanie Matto, Lisa Hamm, Paul Stale, Jesse Meester, Hamza Mokini, Mike Burke, Tom Brooks, Darcy Silver, Usaman Umar, Avery Warner, Michael Ilasanmi, Big Ed Brown, Jasmine Pineda, Jimena Morales, Memphis Smith Genres, Reality TV Seasons, 5 Network, TLC Franchises, 90 Day Fiancé Directors, Brian Spoor Showrunner, Matt Sharp.